7. Stoic Quotes to Embrace Failure and Rise Are you feeling lost? Like life has dealt you a hand of constant setbacks? Maybe it's your job, your relationships, or the weight of unmet expectations. You're not alone. It's okay to feel like a failure. It's okay to struggle. But here's the thing. Failure isn't the end. It's a stepping stone, a lesson waiting to be learned, and a catalyst for growth. Today, I want to share something powerful with you. Seven timeless stoic quotes that have the potential to change your entire perspective. It isn't the things themselves that disturb people, but the judgments that they form about them, attributed to Epictetus, delves into the idea that our perceptions and evaluations of events, rather than the events themselves, often lead to disturbances and emotional distress. Epictetus emphasizes the role of our interpretations and judgments in shaping our emotional reactions. According to Stoicism, events in themselves are neutral. It is our subjective assessments and opinions about these events that determine our emotional responses. Therefore, it's not the external circumstances, but our internal reactions and evaluations that cause disturbance or distress. This teaching encourages individuals to examine their thoughts and interpretations when confronted with challenging situations. By recognizing that our reactions are often influenced by our judgments and perspectives, Stoicism promotes a mindful approach to interpreting events. Practical application of this Stoic teaching involves practicing cognitive reframing and cognitive distancing. It entails consciously examining our initial judgments and assessing whether they align with objective reality. By adopting a more rational and objective viewpoint, individuals can mitigate emotional disturbances and cultivate resilience in the face of adversity. Don't explain your philosophy. Embody it, attributed to Epictetus, underscores the importance of living by one's principles rather than merely talking about them. This principle emphasizes the significance of action and practical application over verbal articulation when it comes to philosophical beliefs. Epictetus urges individuals to live their philosophy through their actions and behaviors rather than relying solely on words to express their beliefs. Stoicism places a strong emphasis on practicing virtues such as wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance in daily life, rather than simply discussing or theorizing about them. This teaching advocates for consistency between one's beliefs and actions. Instead of merely professing philosophical ideals, Stoicism encourages individuals to embody these principles in their conduct, interactions, and decisions. Practically applying this Stoic principle involves aligning one's actions with their philosophical beliefs. It requires a conscious effort to integrate Stoic values into daily life through consistent practice and application. This may involve demonstrating virtues like resilience during adversity, exercising self-control in challenging situations, and showing kindness and empathy in interactions with others. By internalizing and demonstrating Stoic principles through actions, Individuals not only reinforce their own beliefs, but also serve as examples to inspire and influence others positively. It's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. Attributed to Epictetus, underscores the crucial role of our responses and attitudes toward events, rather than the events themselves. Epictetus emphasizes that external events, circumstances, or situations are beyond our direct control. However, what we have complete control over is our reactions, attitudes, and interpretations of these events. Stoicism emphasizes the concept of volition, highlighting that our power lies in our responses and choices, not in external events. This teaching encourages individuals to focus on their internal reactions and responses rather than becoming solely fixated on external occurrences. It suggests that our perspectives, attitudes, and behaviors in response to events determine the impact these events have on our lives. Practically applying this Stoic principle involves cultivating a mindset of acceptance, resilience, and rational evaluation of events. Instead of allowing external circumstances to dictate our emotional state, Stoicism prompts individuals to assess situations objectively, reframing them in a way that enables constructive responses. By consciously choosing how to react, opting for resilience, acceptance, and rationality, 
individuals can navigate life's challenges with greater equanimity and inner strength. The Stoic principle encapsulated in the statement, think your way through difficulties, harsh conditions can be softened, restricted ones can be widened, and heavy ones can weigh less on those who know how to bear them, ascribed to Seneca, elucidates the power of perspective and rational thinking in dealing with life's challenges. This teaching underscores the Stoic belief in the influence of our perceptions and thoughts on how we experience difficulties. It encourages a proactive and deliberate mental approach when facing adversities. Seneca implies that by employing thoughtful and rational strategies, individuals can transform their relationship with hardships, breaking down Seneca's statement, softening harsh conditions. Stoicism advises individuals to employ cognitive strategies to soften the impact of harsh conditions. By reframing our perspectives, focusing on what can be controlled, and accepting what cannot, we can mitigate the emotional toll of challenging circumstances. Widening Restricted Ones Stoics advocate for expanding our mental space and perspective amidst constrained situations. Rather than feeling confined or limited by circumstances, Individuals can broaden their outlook, exploring alternative perspectives and seeking creative solutions to navigate limitations. Reducing the weight of heavy burdens. This teaching emphasizes that the weight of burdens can be lessened by cultivating the inner strength and resilience necessary to bear them. Stoicism encourages developing emotional fortitude, acceptance, and a resilient mindset allowing individuals to confront heavy burdens with greater ease. Practically applying this stoic principle involves engaging in cognitive exercises, such as reframing negative thoughts, practicing gratitude, and focusing on areas within our control. By actively reshaping our perspectives and responses to difficulties, we can alleviate their emotional impact and enhance our capacity to endure and overcome challenges. The stoic principle, encapsulated in the statement, Think your way through difficulties. Harsh conditions can be softened, restricted ones can be widened, and heavy ones can weigh less on those who know how to bear them. Ascribed to Seneca, elucidates the power of perspective and rational thinking in dealing with life's challenges. This teaching underscores the stoic belief in the influence of our perceptions and thoughts on how we experience difficulties. It encourages a proactive and deliberate mental approach when facing adversities. Seneca implies that by employing thoughtful and rational strategies, individuals can transform their relationship with hardships. Breaking down Seneca's statement, softening harsh conditions, Stoicism advises individuals to employ cognitive strategies to soften the impact of harsh conditions. By reframing our perspectives, focusing on what can be controlled, and accepting what cannot, we can mitigate the emotional toll of challenging circumstances widening restricted ones. Stoics advocate for expanding our mental space and perspective amidst constrained situations. Rather than feeling confined or limited by circumstances, individuals can broaden their outlook, exploring alternative perspectives and seeking creative solutions to navigate limitations, reducing the weight of heavy burdens. This teaching emphasizes that the weight of burdens can be lessened by cultivating the inner strength and resilience necessary to bear them. Stoicism encourages developing emotional fortitude, acceptance, and a resilient mindset, allowing individuals to confront heavy burdens with greater ease. Practically applying the Stoic principle involves engaging in cognitive exercises such as reframing negative thoughts, practicing gratitude, and focusing on areas within our control by actively reshaping our perspectives and responses to difficulties. We can alleviate their emotional impact and enhance our capacity to endure and overcome challenges. Seneca's quote, one, a gem cannot be polished without friction, nor a man perfected without trials, encapsulates a fundamental stoic principle regarding personal growth and resilience. This wisdom emphasizes the necessity of challenges and difficulties in refining oneself likening the process to the polishing of a gem. In essence, Stoicism acknowledges that hardships, obstacles, and adversities are integral parts of life. Instead of shying away from these challenges, Stoics embrace them as opportunities for growth, learning, and self-improvement. 
The analogy of polishing a gem suggests that just as friction and pressure enhance a gem's brilliance, facing trials and difficulties strengthens an individual's character and wisdom. Seneca's quote encourages us to reframe our perspective on challenges. Rather than perceiving them solely as obstacles to overcome or endure, Stoicism invites us to view them as essential elements for personal development. Embracing life's trials not only toughens our resolve, but also cultivates resilience, patience, and fortitude. Applying this Stoic teaching involves a mental shift, a conscious reevaluation of how we perceive difficulties. Instead of seeing them as mere inconveniences or sources of suffering, we can approach them as opportunities for self-reflection, introspection, and growth. This mindset empowers us to navigate hardships with a sense of purpose and resilience. Two, the Stoic teaching encapsulated in the phrase, how does it help to make troubles heavier by bemoaning them, underscores the futility of excessive lamentation or distress over our troubles. This principle highlights the Stoic emphasis on managing our emotional responses to adversities. Stoicism doesn't dismiss or deny the existence of difficulties in life. Instead, it encourages individuals to adopt a rational and balanced approach toward their challenges. Bemoaning or excessively lamenting over troubles tends to amplify their weight and impact on our well-being. It intensifies the emotional burden without offering constructive solutions. This Stoic teaching urges individuals to reflect on the practicality and effectiveness of dwelling on their problems. Instead of adding emotional weight to the troubles, Stoicism suggests addressing them with a clear and composed mindset. It advocates for a proactive approach, focusing on solutions and actions rather than wallowing in despair or self-pity. Applying this principle involves cultivating emotional resilience and a rational mindset when facing adversity. It encourages us to acknowledge our challenges without letting them overwhelm us emotionally. By refraining from excessive lamentation, we conserve mental and emotional energy, enabling us to tackle problems more effectively. The Stoic teaching encapsulated in the phrase, we suffer more in our imagination than in reality, attributed to Seneca, addresses the power of our perceptions and thoughts in influencing our experiences of suffering and hardship. Stoicism emphasizes the significance of our interpretations and reactions to events over the events themselves. This teaching suggests that our minds often amplify and exaggerate the potential pain or suffering associated with future events or circumstances. In essence, our imagination and anticipation of adversity often create more distress than the actual experience. By recognizing the tendency of our minds to magnify potential troubles, Stoicism encourages a shift in perspective. It prompts individuals to approach situations with a rational and objective mindset rather than allowing their imaginations to run wild with catastrophic predictions. Practically applying the Stoic principle involves developing mindfulness and awareness of our thought patterns. It requires observing how our minds tend to project and exaggerate future difficulties. Through introspection and mindfulness, we can learn to distinguish between actual challenges and our perceptions of those challenges. Additionally, this teaching encourages the practice of living in the present moment. By focusing on the present rather than dwelling excessively on imagined future hardships, individuals can alleviate unnecessary mental distress and better navigate actual difficulties as they arise.